everyday makeup tutorial. I just want to show you guys what I do for my everyday makeup look. We're gonna do this right now. I'm gonna show you how to look like me. Not that you would ever want to, but if you do... Well, the first thing I'm going to use is Benefit... Actually, no. This is the second thing I do. <laughs> first thing I do is I have this Peter Thomas Roth, I don't even know what it's called, Hydrating Serum. It like makes your face retain water and makes it more like awake. And it's like the same thing that fillers have. It's like hyaluronic acid in it. Yeah, it's made of hyaluronic acid, which like absorbs water. This pretty much hydrates your face. It's like the best face hydrator ever. <laughs> now as a professional, I'm gonna use this. I'm just gonna put a little dab on my hands and mix it up and then put it all over my nose and poor area here. I like to be rough with my face. I hate my hair today. I just got it blown out and then I went swimming and then it's really wet and gross. And I'm just gonna put it back and be all cute like this. Next up, I'm gonna use my foundation. It is Rainforest of the Sea Tarte. I love this foundation so much. I bought another one. I just don't like the, oh, see how it gets so disgusting like this and it kind of like went everywhere. I just hate the applicator. So I'm gonna take a damp beauty brush. I'm gonna just salvage this because there's so many on the outside and that's kind of a little too much because I don't really use too much foundation but now I think this is kind of a lot <laughs> for the sake of the video so I'm just gonna dab that all over my face dab 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 while I dab <laughs> Oh, by the way, I have eyelash extensions on. They're kind of really shitty and I hate them so much. So sometimes I wear like fake eyelashes on top of them. I'm just gonna blend the rest of my neck. I really like this foundation because it's just really super light. Like I don't like cakey makeup. Like I just like a very little bit and very natural. Flawless motherfucker. Next up, I'm going to take my contour kit, which is really gross and disgusting. Dirt and shit gets all over this, but okay, here it is. I'm gonna take, I don't know. I kind of like mix the colors because I don't know what to do and I don't know what brush. I'm gonna just dab in all three of them again. Dab in, just this whole tutorial, just dabbing tutorial. I'm just gonna go like this. I don't really do like the crazy contour stuff because I don't got time. I just, on my cheeks right here, I don't know how to describe this. I just move the brush like in mini circles. I don't even go circles. I just go left to right and just get that all over my cheeks, the apples on my cheeks. The problem that I was doing for so long is that I always do it too low. You're actually supposed to do it more high to make your, your cheekbones appear higher. And it really accentuates the cheekbones, if you know what I mean. I'm just gonna put a little on my nose right here and a little on my chin right there and a little on my forehead. I used to use the cream contour kit, but now I just use the powder one just because it's so much better. Because I do the same thing, I use this brush and then I freaking just dab it in the cream one, which you're not supposed to dab a brush into the cream. You're supposed to like do it and then blend it, but I don't do that. I ain't nobody got time for that, so I don't do that. Okay, so next up, eyeshadow. I got the Tartlet, what is this called? It's just called Tartlet Eyeshadow Palette. I love this palette so much. I never used to wear eyeshadow because the, my eyes were already dark as they are. Like, it looks like I'm wearing eyeshadow. Like, it always looks like I'm wearing eyeshadow. Even when I'm not. So, I'm just gonna take this color. What is it called? No, I don't want that one. It's too dark. Let me do Wanderer. I usually do Power Player, Wanderer, and Force of Nature. So, like, this one, this one, and this one. Just, like, the really natural colors. And it's pretty much the same color as my eye eyelid, I was about to say eyeshadow, eyelid. It's the same color as my eyelid, but better. and just makes it more uniform looking. Because my eyelids, if you look very closely, they're veiny. And ain't nobody want anybody to see veiny eyelids. Natural, but better. That's like the kind of makeup I like. I like, like you, but better. <laughs> there, fabulous. I should probably draw on my brows before I do any more because it'll just make such a huge difference. So we're gonna just take this, Anastasia. What is this even? Everybody uses this dip brow. I forgot what it's called. <laughs> so dip brow in ebony, I feel like, I think this is like the darkest one. And I'm just gonna line my eyebrows a little bit. I feel like I'm all up in your face. I'm sorry. My breath doesn't stink, does it? <sighs> Damn girl, you got that stinky hot breath. 
Plus is just waiting for me right now because we're gonna go get Chipotle, so I gotta hurry up and do this real quick. I want Chipotle. I want Chipotle too! You can't because you're fat. No, you're fat. Okay, I feel like these look bad, but do they look bad? Sometimes. <laughs> I've never done my makeup like this where it's like in front of a little mirror and there's a camera right there It's usually in front of a big mirror So I just like mess with the ends Oh, I just messed that up completely And then I'm gonna take my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer I never knew what any of this is called until like I actually read it right now And I'm just gonna put that under my eyes right there Because my biggest problem area, I feel like the only thing I have to cover is like under my eyes Because under my eyes is really bad because I have these lines, they just absolutely do not go away. I don't know if you can see them because I can't see them in the thing, but like I have this line on this eye and it's like a crease and it does not go away. And people don't notice it. I'm the only one that notices it. But it's like when I look at my face, it's the only thing I see is that thing under my eye. So I'm going to take some of that. I'm going to put it on my nose, highlight a little bit up here. And I'm going to drag it all the way over here give it like that highlight look and dab it some more in my eye hole and pull it up here and you can still see oh you can't see the line all right so i'm gonna take this brush and a little more of the middle contour color brown the brown color the mattest like normalist looking brown <laughs> this one right here because this one's too orangey this one is i don't know this is too orangey i don't think anybody uses that um and then i'm gonna just do like this do like this i should just do the whole video and should be like i'm doing it like this okay and then i'm gonna dab it some more just make everything even. See, my nose looks smaller now. <laughs> I'm gonna take my Makeup Forever Professional, what is it called? HD powder, high definition powder. I love this. I got my makeup done once when I was on set and like this girl used this and it was the best thing ever. Like every five seconds she'd just come and like brush this all over my face and it made me like so not greasy and stuff. <laughs> so I'm just gonna... <coughs> I did too much. I'm gonna just put it everywhere, blend it. Perfect, fabulous. I forgot to do my eyeliner, so we're gonna do my eyeliner. I hate this eyeliner, actually. It's just some NYX Studio Liner. Um, I prefer the felt ones, but I was feeling cheap and I wanted to get a cheap one, so because I used to use the Stilla one. The Stilla one was really good. Okay, I gotta bring this mirror all the way here so I can do my eyeliner because it's like an eyeliner. Hope you guys can see it. No, I don't do my eyeliner like the Instagram beauty tutorial girls because. I still can't do I oh that looks good. <gasps> oh my god, it looks so terrible in real life, but actually it's good on camera. Watch me when I edit this, I'm gonna be like this is terrible. That actually looks good. But in real life it kinda looks bad. <laughs> yeah, but I am not a pro eyeliner put her on her. I'm not a good eyeliner applicator. I suck at doing eyeliner. I was never good at it. I still can barely do a wing. I mean, look how messed up that is. You know what? I don't care. I'm, I'm just going to Chipotle. It's okay. If you have to make funny faces or anything while you do your makeup, it's okay. It is 120% okay to look like an idiot when you do your makeup. <laughs> okay, I think I did that pretty good. Oh, no, 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 I always do that, I always do that. I like, mess it up up here, so I'm gonna, no, it's not coming off. I don't even care. And this is just a mess. I'm trying to make it even. Is it even? This is, this eye, this eye is way too much. It, I put way too much on this eye. I put way too much. Do you see that? Actually, it doesn't look terrible to the point where I have to redo it, but it's acceptable for Chipotle takeout. Like not even sitting inside the restaurant. I'm literally getting takeout. So 
it's all right. Next thing we're gonna do is take more eyeshadow and I'm gonna take it in the color Power Player because I'm a power player and it's like a gray, matte gray. This is the matte, I, what is it? This is the matte, I, what is it called? Eyeshadow, I forgot the word eyeshadow. Eyeshadow palette. So I only like matte colors. I don't like shimmery because shimmery makes me look greasy. I'm just gonna put that on the bottom of my eyelid. I don't like wearing eyeliner, I just like wearing eyeshadow on the bottom eyelid. So now we're gonna do mascara, and I'm just gonna put that all over my bottom eyelashes. And I'm running out of mascara, so this one sucks up. This is, by the way, this is the Maybelline Colossal Volume. I like Maybelline's mascara. I just like the cheap drugstore mascara, I feel like it's better. But then again, I haven't really used expensive ones because when I see expensive mascara, I'm like, why would I pay? $30 for this when I can get a good one for $7. So, I mean, it does everything it's supposed to. It's all just like black, chunky liquid. <laughs> Not even liquid. I don't even know what mascara is made of. What is mascara even made of? My eyelashes are usually huge, but today they're not gonna be that dramatic. They're just gonna be very natural again. Again, Chipotle takeout look of the day. How many layers do I have to do? And we already put eyeshadow, so it's okay if we put a lot. And it's okay if it gets messy. Cause usually when I do this, I like to like sit this close to the mirror and do, oh, why don't I do that right now? Okay, that works. That works so much better. Next, I'm going to take my blush. It is the NARS. Orgasm. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of guys that watch my video, so I'm sure you'll appreciate this blush. And I'm just gonna smile. And put this on. Next up, Becca highlighter. Which one is this one? This one is in Champagne Pop. Like champagne poppies. And I'm just gonna take that. I know I'm not using the right brush, but I don't care what brush you're supposed to use. I don't have the brush that you're supposed to use for highlighting. I don't care. This one looks fine. You can really use any brush for anything. It doesn't matter. Why does it look like there's no highlighter? Sometimes it looks like there's highlighter. Oh, it looks like there's highlight here. And I like to use a lot. Well, until you can actually see it, which is kind of hard. You have to like kind of layer it on if you want people to see your highlight from space. And put a little on my nose, on the bridge of my nose. Ooh, and put some on my lips right here. I haven't even done my lips. This is my favorite part. And I use Anastasia Beverly Hills. This one is called Crush. I got a bunch of the Anastasia ones. They are my favorite liquid lipstick. They are the best. This one is in Crush. I think I just said that. But my lips are kind of chapped and gross and right now. But we're gonna make them look good. And I'm just gonna, I don't use lip liner that often, so I just like use a liquid lipstick as a lip liner and a lipstick. So I'm just like gonna shape my lips however I wanna shape them. So you guys are all like, oh, she got lip injections. But I just make my lips look so much bigger with lipstick, liquid lipstick specifically. I think we're good. Are we good? Are we done? I'm just gonna. Curl my lashes real quick and Sausage thinks this is so painful because he sees me doing this and he's like, what are you doing to yourself? Yeah. Look, I'm curling my lashes, babe. Yeah. You wanna curl your lashes? No. Okay, and I'm gonna take my hair and tease it a little bit. Oh, I don't have a comb right now, so. This is kind of the completed look, my everyday makeup. That only took 20 minutes, actually. If I wasn't talking so much, it would have taken more like 10 minutes. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and the fix and subscribe to join the wolf pack. Ow! Thanks for watching, bye guys.